Hey there, so today I'm going to share with you an organization video on how to store your rings. As you can see, this is how I currently have mine stored, just in this cute little dish type of deal. Not even organized, just all thrown in here, so I kind of wanted to switch that up. So I'm going to share with you guys an idea to keep your rings organized. So what you will need is um, just a container like this, it's an acrylic container. It's the size of a, a portrait, probably like 4 by 6 or so. Um, you will also need scissors and regular tape and some double-sided tape here. You, this might be a little hard to find, uh, but I'm sure you could find it at like craft stores. And it's actually like that foamy type of material that protects like your plates and your cups. So you'll need that. You will also need material. And um, I'm using two colors. I'm just using a plain brown and a pattern with polka dots. So I have um, already pre-cut these to the acrylic part right here. So you're just pretty much gonna place your material and then just cut around it so it's a you get that perfect fit. So let's get started. So the first thing you're gonna do is take your full material and you're just gonna roll upwards all the way to the top and you wanna make sure you roll tightly. So just roll, roll, roll all the way to the top. And I'm not gonna tape it or anything because I've already made some, but what you're gonna do is take your tape and you're just gonna tape right here in the, on the side, the middle, and then the, at the end. Then you're gonna measure it according to your the length of your container. And then of course, just cut off the excess. So once that's done, you're, and it's gonna look like this actually. Sorry, there's like, fabric stuck on here but yeah it's gonna look like that so once you're done you're gonna take your double-sided tape and you're gonna take one of the foamy thingies that you just rolled up and I already did it on this so um, you're just gonna pretty much take some tape the sticky tape and go around and then go around here so you have both sides sticky and then these two sides not sticky and then, of course, when you're done taping that down, you're just going to pat it down so it stays sticky all around. So once you've done all of that, for this size um, container, I'm using about six of these foam thingies. So depending on how, um, how you roll them up and the length and the size of your container. So what we're going to do now is take um, your material right here. And like I mentioned, I did pre-cut them already. And what you're gonna do is grab two of the sticky things, these foamy thingies, and you're gonna place them at each end, like this here, and then also on this end right here. And then what you're gonna do is roll upwards like that, and you're gonna take the other side and roll downwards like this. So you get something that looks like this right here okay and then what you're gonna do just make sure they're kind of tight and stuck to the material and what you're gonna do is take your container and place them place it right inside of the tray just like so like that okay don't worry about the fabric sticking out over here because we can always fix it up and all that and I'm gonna take the next color and just place it on this on one end again and place it on the other end here so you'll roll upwards like that and then you'll roll downwards here just like that again you get that same effect and you place that and just alternating the colors and then the next one i have is the same thing polka dot material. I'm just going to place it here on the top and on, I mean the bottom and the top. So just roll upwards like that and then roll downwards from this end. Okay, so you get the same thing. Alright, so now that I've finished all of them, I'm just going to go ahead and fix them. See, there's like a gap right here. But I'm going to go ahead and just arrange them to where it all fits. And then there you go. 
So you should get something that looks like that. Okay. And then the next thing you're gonna do is just take your scissors and then just poke at the um, material part if it's sticking out, if that bothers you. It doesn't really bother me, but if you just want it to look perfect, just take your scissors and then fix it. Just push it, push it inwards. So yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with how it looks here. So that should be how it turns out right there. And the next step is just to take all of your rings and then start placing them into your little holder here. So I'm just gonna take all my rings that I have. These, I mean, these are just, I have to make another container because I have a lot of rings. So I'm just gonna give you an idea of how it'll look like. It's really cute, I love I love it. It just keeps your rings so organized and like, you know, so easy for you to find like that certain ring you want to wear. Hope you guys could see that. <laughs> and I have a ton of rings, so it's, sometimes it's just hard to find that certain ring you want to wear or whatnot, so. This just makes it really easy. So these are just a few of my rings here. Sorry. And I still have more to do. So I'm going to make another container. So this is how it should look like. Just like that. Really cute and simple. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.